This is DJ Sports Cards. Today is August 2nd, 2010, and here's what I've picked up today so far. Got a bunch of uh, unopened boxes, some current and some older. They're going to be very reasonably priced. This is the guy that comes in about every three weeks or so with a good batch of boxes and prices them near wholesale. So that's what you see up top there. This is a box of stuff we actually picked up before I closed on Saturday with just some newer insert stuff in there. A few game used in autographs. I don't think it's anything exciting, but some decent stuff. Most of it's probably heading for the half-off book. There is some uh, variations from 2010 tops. The old Hall of Fame variation guys there, Ozzie Smith, Brooks Robinson, so some other relics and stuff. Here is a gem mint Mark McGuire rookie. Don't you believe it? There's a nick in the side there. Probably do like $10 on that. So, some other stuff. Um, some more relics. Just bought a collection. A lot of stuff that probably came from Hop Shop at Home years ago. Here's a bunch of TCMA cards from the late 70s. A lot of all-time greats in there. They actually book out okay. They'll be in my half-off book too, or I'd give you a deal on the whole binder. I don't think it's a set, although it's possible. It looks like he sorted them by team. There's Maris. So, oh, is there a mantle in there? There's Santo. So, there's that. Here's a neat Ichiro game used relic piece. Probably go 20 bucks on that. Some more of the Bond bread from 1947. Some customers have alerted me that there's some uh, disagreement as to whether these are authentic or not. They don't know if uh, the warehouse found supposedly was talked about by the more recent sellers was legit or not. So, I don't know. There's opinions on both sides, but they're not too expensive. Here's a Shaq autograph. I'll put a good price on that. Give you a good deal. A few other oddball things here. That's not a real Michael autograph. That's just a gold facsimile signature. Uh, here's some interesting 3x5 card autographs of some players. No COAs on them, but that's probably done before they were doing that stuff. Lauren Pepper, Jim Palagaroni, Rick Waits, Bob Oliver, Frank Pastore, not too exciting. Uh, Bob Lemon autograph. I believe he's a deceased Hall of Famer. Got the COA there, PSA DNA. Mickey Mantle gold card, probably dumped that for five bucks. This has autographs of uh, Larry Doby, Steve Garvey, and Raleigh Fingers, certified. Uh, Ernie Banks autograph Nabisco card. These were a send-in offer from Ritz years ago. There's a Kobe Bryant game used ball card. So some fun stuff that will go cheap. Here's, I think that's a full run of Topps Big Baseball. A couple years worth. Here's some other cheap stuff over here. I've got a bunch of just magazines, cards here. I'm probably gonna put out for free on the sidewalk. In fact, I've got a pile out there now. I'll show you. Here's some stuff that'll go in the dollar bin, some little 3D cards and things. Uh, so either free or it's cheap. There's a nice Sonic poster from the year after they won the championship. It needs some flattening out. And out here is a big stack of free stuff. Hi. Hi. Come on in. So come on down and help yourself while supplies last. Uh, all the items you see in this video, call first if there's something specific you're looking for, depending on when you're watching it, that could be sold already. You can call us at 425. 235-4357 to see if the item's still in stock.